I am honored and humbled to be included in this year's class of inductees into the Colorado Sports Hall of Fame. I'll try to be as brief as I can. Everybody wants to catch the end of the Avs game. Thank you, Tom Lawrence, the selection committee. I learned a lot about the Colorado Sports Hall of Fame over the years, and I've previously attended this banquet as an athlete of the year winner. This is certainly a first class event and a first class organization. I have a great deal of appreciation and respect for my fellow Hall of Fame inductees, especially after listening to their incredible accomplishments tonight. It is a very special, deserving, and incredible group, and I am proud to join them tonight. Rashawn Salam, Coach Sam Pagano, Coach Joe Glenn, Tracy Hill, and Alex the Bullet Burl. I also want to congratulate all the Athlete of the Year winners and especially recognize Jason Horton. Jason, your courage and strength is an inspiration, and it was my honor to get my picture with you, my friend. I am extremely proud to be the 25th Denver Broncos player inducted into the Colorado Sports Hall of Fame. It is a distinguished group with some great players, many of whom are here tonight. That list obviously starts with John Elway. I am thankful to him for bringing me here and making me a Denver Bronco. <clears throat> Reflecting back on March of 2012, I chose Denver because of the talented team, my respect for the organization, and a real appreciation for the football fans here in this city long before becoming a Bronco. And that has only grown in the three seasons Ashley and our family have called Denver home since retiring. Speaking of retiring, the day before I announced my retirement from football three years ago, I shared with my then four-year-old daughter, Mosley is her name, I said, Mosley, tomorrow, Daddy is going to retire. And she looked up at me and she said, does that mean we have to move into one of those homes now? <laughs> Not yet. But. <laughs> Ashley and I are very grateful for the support of the community embracing us, welcoming our family, believing in me, and I am very proud to have won a lot of games together. When you think of the Broncos, you think of a winning tradition. There's been more Super Bowls than losing seasons in the 35 years under Pat Bowen. I want to recognize and thank the Bowen family who are here tonight. We are all thinking of Mr. Bowen, and hopefully the next Hall of Fame dinner we're at is recognizing him in Canton, Ohio. Football is the ultimate team sport. You can't do it alone. I'm thankful for great teammates and coaches during my time in Denver, including Coach Gary Kubiak, who is here tonight. Off the field, <laughs> off the field, thanks to President and CEO Joe Ellis for giving us every resource to succeed. And the support staff of the Denver Broncos is simply second to none. The trainers, equipment staff, video operations, public relations, these are all Hall of Fame people. They take great care of the players, and I am thankful for, for them putting up with me for four years, and I truly value all of your friendships. To Ashley, who is here tonight, to Marshall and Mosley, who better be in bed right now at home, <laughs> as always, thank you for your tremendous love and support. Congratulations again to the inductees and winners. Thank you again for this honor. Have a great night, and go Broncos.